all right guys this is zinc and daily chart now you can see in a daily chart according to the uh, moving average crossover zinc is running in a downtrend still now and we have seen there was a correction from this area just just a minute so we have seen uh, that was a correction again price running toward downside right so most of the people are thinking uh, for entering this market but before we enter in this market we have to analyze in which direction we will uh, will go for buy or sell and if you want to go for short or sell so where is your target so in that case we have to find out some supporting level now question is that how we will identify the support and according to my analysis we are using various type of technique to find out the support and resistance you can visit to my channel and you will find there and let me draw some supporting line i want to connect more recent and more touches point here so you can see i have seen here was multiple rejection in this area right and after that price just bounced from this area all right now we drawn as a support around 184 it's called 184 all right this level and at that time you can see we have seen another multiple rejection that was acting as a uh, you can say support so we have seen this level forming as a support in a daily basis let me show you uh, is it there any weekly support or resistance so we have seen right now there uh what call that one moving average 150 are there but uh, previously we never seen uh any bounce back from moving average 150 so that is why i'm not drawing any support and resistance all right so let's jump to four hour chart in a four hour chart we have seen here some support are there here because uh, this is 200 moving average so you can see here we have seen that was a breakout point right that was uh, like uh, support and resistance are there and we have seen exactly now i wanna i wanna little more uh change this uh line here to exactly near this level let me draw around 186.32 and this level 186.32 that is a support another support so i'm looking for short after breaking this level after breaking this level right price is running continuously downtrend but i'm not going to enter here right now I'm looking for short after breaking a 186.32 level here, this level. All right. So once they break, so I'll start selling from this area. So this is my uh, first sell opportunity. All right. So let me show you how uh, price is running in a in 15 minute chart. So let me show. Uh, in a 15 minute chart, we have seen price beautifully running in a downtrend. Have you seen? Let me. Let me zoom in more zoom in. Yeah. Now you can see price following moving average 20 and 50. Have you seen? Let me show you. Yeah. All right. From here you can see price following moving average 50 bounce. And the retrace from 50 near 50 again bounce. 50 bounce right and after that sometimes they are running like that uh, 20 bounce 20 retrace toward bounce like that 20 bounce and 50 again bounce sometime they are following 50 sometime they are following 20 all right so you can see similarly we have seen here 50 price bounce now they are following 20 20 20 right like that 20 and if you want to enter for the short for intraday who people looking for one rupee or 50 pesos like that the must wait 
to retrace price toward 20 that is called bouncing trading strategy right this is called emf bouncing trading strategy all right so you can trade zinc by using emf bouncing trading strategy like when price will retrace toward this moving average 20 or 50 you can enter for the short remember if somebody uh, they can control their emotion all right they're entering here for the sell directly when price hit and trigger his sell and if you want to enter in this area um, near moving average 20 you just place your sl above 50 because you can see previously market bouncing from moving average 50 all right now you can see let me show you an example here right let me show you so suppose you are trading here by uh, using moving average 20 hit bounce again hit some people are entering here exactly 20 so if they place a little more above here above this 20 moving average see the hit your uh, sl and after that boom market just crash down from this area so that is why if you want to enter in near 20 you just place your ss at least a little more above uh 50 moving average right if you see here is a too far uh, from your entry so you just reduce your lot size don't buy huge amount of lot right uh, that is our trading strategy and use your trading uh, like a profit ratio at least one is to two right one is to two so if you want to place 10 rupees uh sorry uh one rupees sl you just place your two rupees target like that all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching